Ahoy there, Legion! Nefanio's back, and he must really have a thing for security, because while there'll be tons of Moas, Hyenas, Bursas, and a huge new enemy to deal with, the real boss fight is the endless amounts of locked doors you're going to be forced to open each and every time. This right here is unedited footage from a pug on the easy version of the event. After some testing, I can say that whenever you trigger laser traps from, say, getting spotted by a camera, you'll instantly be on full alert status and must reset them to continue. Continue. This goes for everyone in the mission, and you can even re-trigger that same exact camera without a noticeable cooldown, so you might want to dodge that. I'd suggest avoiding all combat and Zerg rush to the boss room. Once there, everyone present has to enter it, just like the original Jackal fight, because he's basically Jackal 2.0. The boss fight is rather action-packed and it's quite puggable, but as this information is nowhere present in the game, if you already tried it and had no idea what was going on, allow me to shed some light. In terms of combat, the Razorback is chock full of excessively damaging attacks. You can choose to stealth them, dodge them, or tank them. That's up to you. Stealthing is fairly self-explanatory. Dodging requires some planning, though. As Razor stomps around, sometimes constant mobility works along with hiding behind a pillar. Other times, ducking into a side room up top is better. You'll note crewmen are up here. You can kill them, but they're just going to respawn five seconds later. Tankiest is the easiest to pull off with the Hysteria Valkyr, but timing up Iron Skin just before soaking up a ton of rocket damage can be rather satisfying. Are you trying to kill me? That's adorable. I'm sorry to say that your damage sustains me, but that is an impressive smoke angel you got there. That's the defensive side of things. Offensively, there are four laser walls on the top floor. There should be a bursa trapped behind one of them shooting at you. Hack the closest console near it and set it free. Now kill it. When dead, you have a short time to hack the console on its back and make it fight for you. Sometimes the AI derps out here, but if you're lucky, it will sacrifice itself, damaging and stunning the Razorback, allowing you a small opportunity to shoot it. Repeat that process a few times and collect you an Orkin Reactor on easy and a Stratus Emblem on hard. The main name of the game here is Avoid Dying. As the fight goes on, the attacks become more frequent, so you're going to need to stay on your toes. Also, good luck with that, as you still have to stand still to hack things. I didn't use any ciphers, but looking back, that probably would have helped. Some Warframe abilities work well, like Trinity can 1-2 combo the Bursa down, and Loki can switch teleport the Bursas out of the laser walls to save you some time. Mag's Bullet Attractor used to have the boss kill itself, but they patched that out. And as of time of recording, Limbo's Rift Walk doesn't really work for this, so not all abilities will behave as you expect. But give it a try, because this event's fairly bite-sized, and if everyone knows what's going on, it could be a pretty fun fight too. You have about a 5% chance to get the Puncture Event mods if you repeat the hard version, but most of the time you'll get the Toxin Status Event ones instead. Free to players, don't forget the Valentine's color palette in the market. Have fun, thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time, Legion. Take care.